Hey, hey, hey guys, this is Hawkeye, and I am back with an episode of Ask Hawkeye. Now, I know it looks like Fishing Planet here, but Ask Hawkeye is basically a series that I had started. I started with Vintage Story, but it is a series that I do, which could be for any of my series. And the point of this is to try to either answer questions or give help or apparently even uh, accept a challenge <laughs> to try to do something but anyway uh, basically what has happened is I got a challenge from one of my viewers uh, she is a very loyal viewer and uh, let me go ahead and show you here real quick the um, the message that I got in the comments from her Yes, here is her message. She basically, this is from Mrs. Spirit Wolf, 1954. I challenge you to get a muskie over 33 pounds with a Chad jig bait there because I can't catch one on it for one of the challenges. So I basically told her challenge accepted and she said, thank you, kind sir. Now, I wasn't really certain what I'm going to have to be able to do to make this work because I haven't tried Shad Bait. I don't even have the mission available yet. So, we're going to basically set this up with the Sal Monster that I have, uh, 8 foot by 10 inch, the uh, Real Fish 5500, and we're going to go with Mono Line, which is about 35 pound test, if I'm not mistaken. X series jig head one and a half ounce and a we're gonna start with a three inch shad but we're gonna try what we can to see if we can get this to work I mean I'll try different colors I'll try different uh, presentations but we're gonna figure it out because once I've been challenged now I have to meet it and I am not gonna let her down anyway guys let me go ahead and get this started all right, it is a very misty morning. It's sunny, and like I had said before, when I go off to the muskie, I usually focus on the peak times, and that will be at approximately, well, actually, it's there now. It's 6.05, and I'm going to go ahead and try to fish that spot that I did in the last episode that managed to get us a unique muskie, uh, trophy muskie, and see what we can do with this but we're going to start off with a lift and drop and I'm going to try about every presentation I can think of in different speeds this will probably take me a little while but once I start making progress or if something starts to happen I'll bring you back and we'll looks like I got a snag <laughs> I will let you know what worked and we shall see what happens guys Alright, we have tried several things. I've tried the I tried a three ounce orange shad. I tried a one with a red tip. I tried a glow in the dark one. I have tried uh, quite a few of them actually. <laughs> and I've tried different presentations, stop and go, uh, lift and drop, twitching. But I went ahead and bought this big one, a four aught four inch shad. It's green, and the reason I went ahead and bought that is because, well, they really went for the Gollum lure, as you well know from the last episode, and I thought, well, maybe, maybe that's what they like. Maybe that's the color they like, and if I, I get a little bit bigger one, maybe it'll be more attractive to them, but I've been, I haven't had any bites just yet, but I'm not giving up yet, guys. I am determined, and I'm still within the peak. It's 6.43 a.m., Right now I'm trying a straight presentation just to see because the Gollum lure that's pretty much what you're using is a straight presentation and if in qu answer to the question that somebody gave me where did I get the Gollum lure that came from the Gollum muskie mission the monster mission if you do that mission you will get this lure so whoa holy crikeys Holy crap. I think I got one, guys. That That was it. That's what I needed to do. And it was a lift and drop, guys. That's what he bit it on, a lift and drop, not a straight. 
was not a twitch it was a lift and drop those are it's a kind of a hard presentation to do and it's takes a lot of of practice to master it but I tell you the muskie always did go for the lift and drop as do the pike but the, yeah I think this is a big fish guys I think we're gonna get our 33 pounder plus hopefully Oh my goodness, I cannot believe I did this. <laughs> Holy crap. Not only did I get it, but I got another unique. 44.416 pounds. Look at that guy. Miss Spirit Wolf, what do you think? It can be done. It can be done. Yep. I'm going to go ahead and thank these guys. Yeah, these guys are really nice around here. I've been talking to them while I've been trying this out. Yep, I was challenged to catch one with a shad. A jig shad or whatever. Yep, I did manage to make it happen. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, I always try to respond to people when I'm on here. Now, occasionally, let's see if we can get another one. Occasionally, um, it can be done. The lift and drop. Yep. And we're going to see if we can get us another one here, guys. Yeah, and these guys will get to be on the video with me as well. They got to share it with me. Looks like Easter 333 is right over there. Hey, Easter 333, you're on Candid Camera. <laughs> yep. It's me. <laughs> Every now and then I get that. It's kind of a weird thing when people recognize me on this. Yep, one of my viewers challenged me. <laughs> anyway, let's see if we can get another one first. Let's see. Answer this guy. Yeah, I just wanted to make sure he got what I was trying to do there. <laughs> nice. Say hi to my viewers. will get a little bit of camera time themselves why not anyway let's see something else here guys try to lift the drop again I'll be damned <laughs> son of a gun I will be damned Holy crap. Yep. Yep, yep. We have found the lure. We have found the presentation. And let's see what we got. Yep. It's another muskie. It's not 33 pounds or better, but it is a muskie. Hey, you know, nothing to sneeze at. You know what I mean? Little guy. <laughs> oh, well, hey, he's a fish. He's a good fish. Well, guys, I think we have proven what can be done and that they do go for this. So, anyway, I hope you enjoyed this episode. And I do encourage you guys to ask questions, put things down in the comments below. 
on any of my series. It could be this Fishing Planet series. It could be The Fisherman. It could be uh, the, Fisherman, the Fisher Online. It could be, well, I can't do Vintage Store anymore, but uh, any of the series that I'm currently doing. If you have questions, you want to know how to do something, or you just want to see and what I can actually do in regards to catching things, just <coughs> give me a give me a comment, and I might go ahead and give it a try. But anyway, guys, as I said before, I hope you enjoyed this episode, and I hope it was some help. And please be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe. And as I always say, aim straight, cast far, and have fun, and I will... See you later. Bye-bye.